right. It does look a lot better in person. I own 2022 High Country Duramax. How's that feel? Doesn't sound real. <laughs> Yo, yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video and welcome to the day that Raphael Pena is gonna be landing in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania to take delivery of Lone Star. It's gonna be a sad day yet such an exciting day here on the vlog because we're celebrating the goodbye of Lone Star and giving it to its next owner, but we're saying goodbye to Lone Star and that's somewhat sad. So as you guys saw in the last vlog, we had put some sick 22 factory wheels on the wife's Yukon Denali Duramax and they turned out fantastic. We did rock lights on Super Duty Sam version two and Brody came up and hooked us up with some personalized tint delivery service. And all while that was going down, it was snowing a lot. Now I love snow and I welcome it all the time, but it can make for some logistical challenges of which you can deal with when trying to fly. Raphael unfortunately dealt with exactly that. He opted to fly up from Virginia rather than drive because he's currently stationed in the Navy in Hampton, Virginia and does not have a vehicle. Fortunately, we are here to help him with that because he was drawn from Compliance Sweepstakes Service, our third-party sweepstakes administrator, as the winner of Lone Star. And he's actually originally from the Lone Star State down in Brownsville, Texas, which is ultimately like right on the border. We are talking as far south as the U.S. goes. So today, he was actually supposed to get here about three and a half hours ago, but his flight from Philadelphia connecting out to Harrisburg got delayed three times. Fortunately, he's now in the air and he is set to arrive within a half hour. So in the typical case in point, we would bring Lone Star and pick him up from the airport in it, but being that it is nasty outside and impossible to keep any vehicle clean, once we pull it right out of this door, we're actually gonna bring the LBZ, pick him up, head down to the notary, get everything registered in his name, and then bring him back here to surprise him with his new dream truck. So boys and girls, if you haven't heard, Dream Diesel Giveaway number 22 is live and it's not Jake's LBZ. We're actually taking the LBZ today because it's filthy outside. You can see it's already filthy. Rather, it's Ghost. This 2018 Laramie Factory Paint Match Sport Edition Cummins, that's not just that, but it's got a big turbo, an S460 7.7 by our boys, none other than at World Custom Fab. It's got a second gen speed speed manifold, ARP 625s, a Muldoon Stage 2 transmission, some 24 by 14 concave gloss black American Force Nemesis, a whole bunch of other mods, and it comes with $30,000 cash. Now, as we typically do, the max multiplier for this giveaway is live as you're seeing this video on Thursday and the deadline for 10 times entries this giveaway's highest multiplier is on the 18th of January so if you guys want to get entered for a chance to truly take home one of the cleanest fourth gens that's ever existed and is ultimately eight balls younger brother then your chance is right now seriously though guys look at this thing we actually pulled it out last night before the storm because I wanted to get some snow pictures with it most of the snow is melted off of it now take a minute to appreciate how beautiful this thing is we had these wheels powder coated because we could only find them in Chrome, it was the easiest way to get them. And the powder coat, they look sick on this truck. I know everybody's not into stretch tires, but this one, it just complemented perfectly. This thing looks incredible, but it sounds even better. If you guys missed the announcement video that went up last Tuesday on the channel, which was the 11th of January, you're definitely gonna wanna check it out right here above because the list of mods on that truck is definitely worth noting for when you could be taking it home and because it tells quite a cool story. So we're here at the airport. Finally, Raphael has arrived. We're just waiting for him to deboard. He should be walking around this corner or maybe that corner momentarily. A few moments later. Ladies and gentlemen, there he is right there. The winner of Dream Diesel giveaway number 21. Raphael Pena up here in Pennsylvania. My man finally made it. It's the man, the myth, the legend. What's up, bro? Welcome to Pennsylvania, oh, my man. I'm, I'm really glad cold. you finally made it, dude. It's That's really, it. It's it's really cool. Congratulations, welcome. Dude, I was getting a little bit worried with all of these delays. It was like one after the next, oh, after the next. Oh my God, it was so ridiculous. I, I feel like I was in a circus or something. I know, I know, I know. How you I feeling, started, man? I know oh, you, uh, you were up all night cold. working. Oh yeah. But you're energized? Yeah, I mean, you know, I've, if we have to I get you that sleep. bottle of tequila, so excited, bro, man. I will. I'll get it for you. <laughs> this man right here, he's like, dude, maybe I'll just do a shot of tequila when I get there, and it'll hey, wake me up a little that's bit. That's the way to do it. That's the way to stay up. <laughs> that's awesome, man. Well, yo, let's uh, let's jump in the LBZ. Yeah. Good to finally have you up here, man. Were you able to get any sleep though? Cause uh, I, I, maybe like 10 minutes, but I was so excited I couldn't sleep. You want us to stop and get your Red Bull or something like that, dude? We're, we're happy oh. to make a pit stop. Yeah. 
I'm fine for right now. All right, like, yeah, just my let blood's us know, man. <laughs> Heck yeah, that's awesome. Man. It's really good to have I you. I've here. definitely been up more than 24 hours though. <laughs> but dude, when you get to that point, you just hit this like wall, and you're like, <laughs> I'm not even tired anymore. Like I'm, I'm just good. I'm just good to function. I love but, that part. <laughs> yeah. So tell me about, uh, tell us about your role. What do you do? Well, I, I work with like aviation fuels. You know, yeah. I, Aircraft. Doing so you like up on on the flight deck then? Yeah, yeah. So you borrowed a carrier. Yeah, I am. Yeah. yeah, I was uh, I was actually stationed in Japan before I came to Virginia for like almost four years. Get out of here, dude. Yeah. Was, so how long have you been in the Navy? Almost five. Nice. Yeah, in May, I hit five years. Thanks a ton for your service, dude. Really appreciate it, man. It means a lot. Yeah, it was a, uh, I was about you know relocate to you know civilian life, and uh, I was like, I told my wife like I really need a new truck. You know, my truck's old. I don't think it will make it across, across the country back, even though it made it this far. <laughs> it made it from South Texas to Virginia. Then you called me <laughs> like, when I was going to go back to Texas to drop off my truck and get a new one. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> How about timing, dude, right? Yeah, yeah that, that's another thing, too. Like, I just put in, like, well, I'm on uh, leave, which is, like, vacation days, okay. I guess you said. Yeah. And... Like I said, you called me and it's like this week I'm on vacation. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so. And bro, the fact that like Lone Star, right? The reason that I named Lone Star Lone Star is because Jake and I typically tackle the builds ourselves, right? Yeah. But Jake was out on like this two week like West Coast hunting backpacking trip in Idaho. I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna take this truck on myself, wrapping it tan, and I'm like, you know, I'm doing it on my own. So like Lone Star, kind of on my own, if you will. Yeah. And it was gonna be the last truck that we really got to work on in my old shop. So I figured it was like a cool kind of triple meaning, if you will. Yeah. Not a yeah. just going to Texas, dude. Yeah. Like, I mean, come on. Yeah. That is just absolutely incredible, man. The, the timing and the coincidence and all of this is really weird. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, like every single instance when we get to meet a winner, bring them out into Pennsylvania, and get to know them a little bit, they always have these just insane stories that make everything make so much sense. Yeah. It is super cool. Yeah, yeah. This is the first time I see snow like this. Like, I've seen like, because uh, it snowed recently in Virginia, it was like a light sheet over it, and it melted over the night. You know? okay. Like this is the most snow I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> yeah, man, it's, it was it was good timing. This is like the first time it's really snowed this season, but I'm glad at least your flight was able to get here. Like I told my wife, I said I'm I'm a little worried. Like what if they just cancel the last delay, yeah. and then like you know they end up putting you up somewhere. I just, truthfully, I would have driven out to Philly to get you then. I feel like it's not real until I'm in the driver's seat. To be honest. Yeah, we found that with a lot of our winners, they actually get the truck home and it's still like one or two weeks afterwards when they're like, all right, all right, it's still there. Like, it's still there, it's still there. It's my yeah. truck now, you know like, what I mean? I, I want to say every night before I woke up for work, I kind of woke up, I was like, did he really like call me and text me? And I look at my text, I was like, he did. All right, all right, all right we're good, we're good. Like, I'm not dreaming, I'm not dreaming. Yo, and your buddy's reaction was pretty hilarious. Oh, he's yeah. like, he's like, you want a truck? <laughs> what? He, he didn't believe me at first. And he was like, there's no way, like, you know, you see a bunch of those like Instagram ads. Like, the you do. Media. There is a yeah. lot of stuff that we deal with on Instagram. We even got pages impersonating us all the time, man. Yeah, and we're like, we're messaging Facebook all the time. We even had like, you know, my lawyer reached out to Facebook and said, hey, we got to do something about this, but they just, they just can't do nothing about it. Yeah, guys, if you ever see that on Instagram, please do us a huge favor. You are our front line of defense. Please just go ahead and report those. I know they're super annoying and I am not going to give up until we can try and get some sort of restitution with it. But in the time being, all we can do is just beat the crap out of these pages, report and block them as fast as we can. I'm going to go to Virginia tonight because I still got to pick up my, my trailer and my truck. So. Okay, cool. So are you putting your other Silverado on the trailer behind this Silverado? Or, I'm yes. sorry, your Sierra on the trailer behind the Lone Silver Star? Yes. Nice, man. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, it tows really good. We validated that a few times, <laughs> man. It works great. I'm pretty excited, you know. Like, like I said, I always wanted a Duramax, and it's just a weird <laughs> coincidence that I want exactly what I wanted. You got yourself a brand new one, man. I, so I was about to buy a Denali for a, that had 120,000 miles on it. And it's crazy, man. Like, the pricing is still astronomical. Yeah. Boys and girls, as per usual, step number one is where I become somewhat of a pastor to make this marriage official. You haven't even <laughs> seen the truck, so it's kind of somewhat of a blind date. But do you trust us? I mean... I've seen the pictures, so that, <laughs> I think that's good enough for me. Heck yeah, man. Awesome. You know, I got to give you a lot of credit for running on basically being awake for 24 yeah. hours right now. You got a big old smile. I'd be yeah. probably sleeping right there. No, no. I, I have to stay excited. A truck of my dreams. That's <laughs> it, man. All right. We're one step close. We're going to go inside and get this thing registered in your name.
just committed to something that you haven't even seen yet, but yeah. trust the process, brother. It's gonna be completely worth it. We are just one step away. We're gonna be heading up to the shot now so you can see this thing. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Hell yeah, brother. You've traveled all day for this. My man's got some patience. Definitely more patient than I could ever be. All right, boys and girls, we're back, and Raphael's about to see Lone Star for the very first time, but we're testing his patience for just a little yeah. bit longer because Casey's running in and setting up her camera setup on the gimbal, and then we're gonna get his reaction, bro. I'm super excited for you yeah, to see I'm, this truck. I'm, I'm so excited. But dude, meanwhile, what do you think of Dream Diesel giveaway number 22? I think it looks really nice, bro. Oh my god, wait. <laughs> I mean, that's a must, honestly. We're gonna get a really, really, really cold start on a second gen swap S467.767 Cummins. It's about to be pretty glorious. Oh. Diesel preheat's 100% necessary right now. Ooh, I'm excited oh. for this. You gotta tell them. Do you think it's worth entering for that truck? I, I think it's, I, I will try to enter for this truck, honestly. Because <laughs> imagine, guys, you could be in his shoes in just a month and a half's time, but to take delivery of that thing right there and $30,000 in cold, hard cash. And yes, it will be cold, because it's rather cold here in Pennsylvania as we speak. You know, meanwhile, we're just gonna let Ghost out here warm up, because we will be pulling him back in the shop, but in the shop is where we need to go, dude. Are you ready to see your truck? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> Let's do this, bro. Come on in. The culmination of all of those delays oh and all God. of that lack of sleep that you've had for this very moment in time. Come on in, man. I'm gonna sort out my hat meanwhile, because I'm gonna get all excited and start sweating. All right, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> Are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. The honors are all yours, my friend. Oh, oh that's a sliding door. <laughs> that's our fault. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, it does look a lot better in person. <laughs> Here and check this out, ready? Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude! That's your drop, man. Right there. Good job on the wrap. Oh. Say it with me. I own a 2022 High Country Duramax. I own 2022 High Country Duramax. How's that feel? Doesn't sound real. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't sound real. Oh my god. <laughs> dude, this is crazy. Everything, every, it just looks, everything all together just looks amazing. It's almost like a note. It's a lot better in person. That's like, I'm trying to like comprehend. Like, yeah, videos and, and pictures do the truck a lot of justice, but not 110%. Until you're here next to it. <laughs> yeah, dude, open it up, man. It's all yours. You don't have to ask us any permission whatsoever. I mean, dude, like the seats too. I think oh. they're still kind of a little stiff because they ain't even broken in yet, man. <laughs> 596 miles on the odometer. I mean, if it's too much, I can take it back. No, you, no. I mean, just, all right, think about it's it. Think about mine, it. Right? <laughs> it's already mine, all right? <laughs> can't, can't take it back now. So look, man, it's full, fully loaded from the factory. You got everything, like GM factory power folding steps, illuminated lights. You got rock lights all around this thing, all LED lighting, the full Anosa tech. This is called sand, the wrap. So we, ne we never really refer to it as sand tan, but obviously it works out really well. All the paint match that was done is to the factory black color that the truck is by Peach Bottom Auto Body. You got your wrap completely done by Brody at Accelerate Auto. Windows tinted 5% all the way around with 45% on the windshield. Suspension wise, you're looking at a, a four inch Cognito lift kit. Literally the best lift kit in the game for the GM trucks, these new 2020 plus GM trucks. And then you got yourself a set of really sick Genesis 2414 gloss black concave American Force wheels on a 33 by 14 and a half Venom uh, RT honest, tire. <laughs> so y'all, on these Silverados too, you ever seen this? You hit the button, it's power fold down. No, this is new to me. And then check this out, man. Hit that button again. 
Dude, that's crazy. <laughs> Power fold up tailgate. You can do that from your remote too. Yeah, we appreciate you having patience with us because like we got this thing spotless for you and we didn't want to take it out today. Obviously it would have gotten pretty dirty. But we're going to leave that up to you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm ready to take it for a spin. <laughs> Yo, we will. We will. Absolutely, man. We'll get a uh, Super Duty Sam version two out of the way here and then we'll go out and we'll start rolling. Now Raphael, I'd say most importantly is the truck, but second most important, it's the 30 grand cash that this thing comes along with, bro. Yeah, I mean, you keep safe keeping of that right there because that is not a prop, my friend. I think you guys did a good job of everything. Thank you. Thank you. Well, look, man, we're super grateful for your support as well, bro. I mean, without people like yourself, we wouldn't be able to make this possible. And truthfully, bro, we're just stoked for you, man. You look right at home with this thing. You got just like the stars and everything as well, bro. It just fits right in with this. making the marriage super official. Bro, you're slipping the ring on the finger, dude. No turning back at this point, bro. I'm gonna get a custom plate for the whole star. That'd be perfect. Slow STR. There you go, I like that. Yo, congratulations again, man. Super pumped for you, bro. Thank you. That is awesome. All right, boys and girls, it's time for Raphael's maiden voyage in the High Country Duramax. Say goodbye to the clean, sterile Lone Star that is right now, because the instant we pull this thing out, man, it's gonna be filthy. It is so new. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, so I see you st found your Starlight Headliner <laughs> remote. You can also download the app. I'll text it to you and you can control it from your phone as well. You got sunroof, bro? Like whole nine yards, man. You ready to rock? How about it? How about it? <laughs> it's crazy how dark it is in here. Yeah, right, dude? The <laughs> ultimate privacy, bro. Dude, the Starlight Headliner looks unbelievable. It wow. Looks crazy. Ladies and gentlemen, bear with us slightly. We are behind 5% window tint with some windshield tint. Just believe us, Raphael's right there. You might not be able to see him, but I'm, he's, I'm he's smiling. <laughs> here, hold on, let me open this up a little bit. Maybe we'll get some ambient light going so you guys can geolocate us here. <laughs> this thing is awesome. <laughs> all right, all right, seatbelts, 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 everybody. I must seatbelts. <laughs> I miss driving a diesel, this is, this is amazing. So does it feel right at home for you? Oh yeah, it feels, it feels like riding a bicycle. So you got a fully loaded truck, man. Um, it's got, it's got you know your exhaust brake, your heated seat button right here, cooled seat button, brake. your exhaust brake. So when you're towing and you're in tow haul mode, it's gonna use the turbo to actually you know, oh, okay. like a Jake brake on a big truck. You know what I mean? Yeah, okay. Heated steering wheel is this button right there. So you got that ready to rock and roll. Dual climate control. Obviously the enthusiast bullet antenna. Couldn't give you a truck without one of those. It adds like 150 horsepower too. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, man. The sticker. I mean the sticker's everything. That's where you get your aerodynamics and fuel economy from. <laughs> <laughs> still, driving it, it just feels like I'm not like I'm not awake right now. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna be I'm good to drive home? Still... You want me to grab you like a Red Bull when we fuel up or I anything think, like that? Like, what do you prefer, Red Bull Monster? Like you like the, Bang Energies? No, nah, I will do the uh, Mean Bean Monster. A Mean Green Monster? Mean Bean. What's Mean Bean? bean? Oh, is that is the that one of the monster? the coffee monsters? Are they pretty good? I've never had I, one. I used to drink them all the time when I was on deployment. So okay, it would get me up. So I I feel like. But I don't drink energy drinks like that. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I just use raw willpower. That's it, up. man. I like to hear it. <laughs> dopamine. Yeah, dopamine. Kind of cool for you because these GM trucks are so long in the front. You go to camera and you have oh, a complete cool. view of your front. 360. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, dude. Like 360, you can go to the back. But yeah, so you have your sides too. You can look at your wheels. Like you um, can look at it all. Look at the lights now, dude, at night. <laughs> I mean, it just looks absurd. This man goes in and buys three monsters and they just so happen to consequently match Lone Star <laughs> perfectly. It's like it was completely meant to be. And you even have three cup holders to make them right at home. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta make sure I stay up. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. It's a Raphael. Tell everybody about, about what, 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 your, I, what your, uh, one of your uh, goals is here. I need to jump in the snow. I need All right. To. <laughs> All right, my man, if you insist on it, I gave you my warning. It's gonna be cold. This man is insane. <laughs> oh my god i'm so cold now just looking at you bro all right dust it off dust it off dust it off so it don't melt all over you 
Oh my god, was it worth oh, it? That was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that was epic, man. I can't say I've ever had anybody do that before. Here, come on in. I'll get you a quick rag. That way you can wipe yourself off. Jumps right in the snow. Burr. Dude, I'm cold just thinking about it. There you go, man. B bucket list check. <laughs> bucket list check right there. One of the life goals right there? Check. check. Right Win here. a truck, get a bunch of cash, and jump in the snow. Yep. This man's got very, very simple needs. <laughs> That's all I need. <laughs> Yeah. Drive with Duramax and jump in the snow. <laughs> All right, bro. So I think that you had a pretty eventful day up here in Pennsylvania, great, man. It, it, was it was an absolute day. pleasure meeting you, dude. Thanks again for being patient with the whole travel process. Sorry it didn't work out as buttery <laughs> smooth, but hey, at the end of the day, it was completely worth it. At the end of the day, I, have, I own this. You own this truck now, matters. man. No payments, title in hand, and it is 100% yours. Going back to Texas, which is absolutely wild. He just started his leave, so he's going to be headed back down there after he stops in at Hampton, Virginia tonight to get some sleep because he's running on basically yeah. 30 hours awake at this yeah. point in time. Time. Zero sleep, 30 hours awake. Yep. That's it, man. <laughs> all right. Well, Raphael, well, it was a pleasure, man. God bless you, brother. Thanks again for your service. We but, all greatly appreciate it. I would do it again, but... <laughs> That's it, man. <laughs> this is a once-in-a-lifetime moment. It is. It is. Well, cheers, brother. Safe travels home and enjoy the truck, man. Thank you. Appreciate Take care. It. Damn. Another one. I want to watch it leave. Oh. This is always such a bittersweet moment on the vlog. Four-wheel drive, climbing right out of that ice and snow. It's his first time ever in snow. Jumps in the snow, driving in the snow. And there she goes. Straight up spaceship. I miss it. I miss it already. Lone Star, man. What a legend. That's what we do in these parts. We build legends, and we give you a chance to take them home. And the next one up on the chopping block is that one right there which could be yours and 10 times entries are live through the 18th boys and girls you just saw it for yourself for the 21st time and number 22 could be you